Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Cara and I make new videos every single day, so please do consider subscribing. Um, I'm gonna do a makeup video today and I'm gonna do something I've never... Oh. I'm gonna do something I've never done before. I never wear the colour blue. I never do blue eye makeup. I just don't do it. Like, my mum when I was a kid always said like, blue and green should never be seen unless there's beauty in between. She would always say that and because I have green eyes I was like, I can never wear blue. But like, today I thought like, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try blue eyeshadow. And I was thinking, I'm gonna make it fun because I want to do something cool with it. So I'm gonna do like, oh maybe like a really nice blue cut crease and then like, you know the way people do like the white graphic eyeliner and do clouds or something? I'm gonna do that. I've already um, cleansed, toned, moisturised my face, concealed and powdered my eyelids and I drew on my eyebrows. So let's get started. My go-to eyeshadow palette which is the Morphe Pride palette. I love this. I got it for Christmas about two years ago. I actually got two of them. I got one off Amy and one off my mum and I use both of them. <laughs> I think it's deadly so... Hmm, there's quite dark blues in here. That's exactly what we want to go for. So I'm going to be using the Be Perfect Cosmetics Carnival palette. Amy got me this one for my birthday this year, actually, I believe. And I'm going to go in with this blue. <gasps> Isn't that so pretty? And that blue is called Sky. Really nice. Okay, I just had to fix the exposure there. Now we're all okay and we're going to get into it. And the first eyeshadow I'm going to be going in with, this sort of light blue minty green. And that's going to be our transition colour that's going to go... Uh, just above our crease. I always see these fun eye looks with the graphic eyeliner and drawing like rainbows or clouds and I always think it looks so pretty so I thought I would try it today. Why not? And go in with that one colour that scares me because I have green eyes. I'm just going to continue to do this till we have a nice blend of that minty green blue turquoise <laughs> whatever color that is and now we're going to go in with this lovely blue shade sky and we're just going to put that pretty much along <laughs> halfway on the eyelid to the outer corner and we're just going to drag that up a little I feel so free with this today because I'm not going anywhere. It's a rainy day. I'm staying in, so uh, I was gonna do whatever <laughs> I think looks nice. Um, I just noticed that in this palette, there's this lovely navy blue under the color sky. So I'm gonna go in with that and do pretty much the exact same thing. Just put it on the outer corner and drag it up a little bit. Just gives the eyeshadow a bit more depth to do this. I think it's really pretty but I just don't think it goes with my green eyes but so far I do think the like difference of colour is really nice dark blue and light blue yeah as I was saying the um different shades of blue and mixing all together it looks really nice I like it I feel like I might be getting a bit mixed up with the transition shade though so I'm gonna take um just a small brush and that minty bluey turquoisey colour and it's gonna blend out the edges. So pretty. And now, just to be a little bit more dramatic, I'm gonna take black right in the outer corner and just blend it out. Isn't that so pretty? Oh my God. I think that looks so nice. I really like it. <laughs> I mean, it's very messy at the moment, but I can imagine when this is cleaned up and then uh, doing the bottom of the eyes as well, I think I might go for more sort of like navy and black at the bottom. It'll be so pretty with this. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna take this little flat brush and I'm gonna do a cut crease or half cut crease. Mm -hmm. 
I'm just gonna take a white eyeshadow and set this concealer. I'm gonna take the mint color again and just make sure all of this is nicely blended. And I'm gonna go in with Sky and do pretty much the exact same thing. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is take a makeup wipe and just clean up my eyes. I actually really love everything about this. I love the transition of colors. I just think it's so pretty. So now, um, I think what I'm gonna do is go and do my face makeup. Yeah, so I'm just gonna do my face makeup now and I'm gonna start off with the Cisco Pear Tiger Grass color corrector. I uh, add the green stuff. I'm just gonna put it on my face wherever I have any redness. Okay, so if you watched a few of my makeup videos, you'll know that I do not like full coverage foundation. I usually use a BB cream because it's just a lot, like, I don't mind if I have some spots and you can see them. It doesn't bother me. I just like a little bit of coverage on my skin because I use concealer and contour and everything anyway. But today, I'm going in with full coverage foundation, the Vichy Derma Blend. I really like this. I really like this foundation. It's really nice. It doesn't feel all, like masked the way, um the KBD one did, but uh, I really like this. It's very nice. So I'm gonna put it on now. I have it in the shade Porcelain. I'm now gonna go in with my concealer and just put it on my chin under my eyes, forehead, and then maybe a little bit on my jaw. I'm just gonna go and contour now, and to do that, I use the KVD Shade and Light Palette. I have the cream and the powder contour, and I use both of them, and they're really good. Okay, I'm just gonna go and set my powder contour and do blush and maybe set my face powder all together and then I'll be back. I'm gonna go do the bottom eyeshadow and then I'm gonna do my eyeliner and then I'm gonna do my graphic eyeliner. I'm not gonna lie, I actually really like this. I like this eyeliner. I never do any crazy eyeliner. I usually just do like eyeliner from there, but like I actually don't like the inner corners, which I never do. I'm gonna take some, I'm just gonna take some black eyeliner and go over my water lines. But now I don't wanna do the clouds. Now I'm like, oh, I like it. <laughs> Guys, I really don't want to do the clouds on it now because I, I really like it. I actually do. I even like it with my eyes, which is a surprise. But um, I'll do it, but I don't want to. Oh, but I just like don't know. Like I'm only doing like what one cloud. I don't know. I really like it. I don't want to ruin it. Hmm. 
Not me forgetting to put mascara on. Give me a sec. <laughs> this is the finished look with mascara on and I really like it. I'm gonna go do the clouds now. I'm gonna do like one here and one here. And it's probably gonna turn out terrible and then I'm gonna be all like, I hate it now. But you know what? You gotta try. I said I would, so I'm gonna. But I'm kinda worried like what if the what if the um eyeshadow transfers back to my white eyeliner? Then my white eyeliner is like ruined. Alright, fine, let's do it. You happy with that because you know what i think i liked it before the graphic liner but you know what it's not too bad so that is the look for today if you enjoyed the video please do leave a like leave a comment uh helps me know you like the video or consider subscribing because i make new videos every single day i can't think of another reason for that. <laughs> um now my cloud is smudging mm. okay Well, that's the video. Thumbs to clouds. That's it. Okay, I'm gonna go and regret putting the clouds on. So thank you so much for watching and I will be back tomorrow with another video and I have a special video coming on Monday. Kind of, it's it's kind of not really special for anyone but me, but it's going to be a good one, so uh, <laughs> tune in on Monday for uh, a very odd vlog. Mm -hmm.